this world can't fully satisfy us. We're 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 God breathed. We can right. so if if we're God breathed, do you think it's so un, un, unreasonable to imagine that God would send His only Son to communicate? That was His plan, that He would bring Jesus. So Jesus said, "If you've seen Me, you've seen the Father. I'm the way, so that you come into a relationship. Seek first the kingdom and His righteousness." And he told them to go into Jerusalem, wait for the promise of the Father, the Holy Spirit that's given, so that the Holy Spirit comes from beyond and from deep within, joins with our spirits, and gives us life. And then we're enjoying the best of life in these bodies. And in the future, after we die, we, we have the promise of the resurrection, a resurrection body like that of Jesus when he rose from the dead. But God is going to make all things right to give us new life, meaningful life, life that really matters right now. You know, Doc, it's uh, very interesting because when we talk about 21st century Christianity and Gentiles, um, there's so much division, racism, classism, sexism, all kinds of isms, and when we talk about the good news of the kingdom, I believe that it is the message of the kingdom. It is the only message that can unite all men in a unified central faith in the one true king, the Lord Jesus Christ. And what God does in the kingdom is he brings back together what the enemy divided. 